Thank you, thank you, thank you so much. Thank you. This is like my own version of a daytime Emmy. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Greetings, Earthlings. I am James McDonald, and I'm back with another high five Friday. <laughs> Hey, happy High Five Friday to all of you out there doing it like you're doing it. We're back at it again with the back at it again, and I'm here to remind you that you do have some rights. You have the right to do some things. And, you know, just in case you're in a slump and you forget what your rights are, I'm here to remind you of them right now. So, let's go. So, you have the right to be your awkward and weird self. Yes, I'm kind of calling you out. Don't be that person you compare yourself to. We are not supposed to be that person. I'm an awkward black boy. I love being that because that's my uniqueness. That's my diversity. That's yours as well. So embrace who you are, all of those quirks, because it's what makes you you. Yes. So next, you have the right to be smart and figure things out. You have the capabilities, you have the knowledge, you, you have that. So dig in, allow yourself to share from your areas of expertise. Next, you have the right to not know and say so. We don't know everything, we just don't. So I'm okay, you should be okay with saying, you know what, I actually don't know. Let me look into this for you, or if you like, let's both look together. So be okay with saying you don't know something. You go a long way with that. Next, you have the right to fight for yourself. Sometimes it's tough to wait around for someone to see the value that's within you. Sometimes you have actually have to put yourself out there and say, this is who I am. This is how I'm defining myself. Don't let others define you. You do that work, okay? So remember, Exercise your rights because they are yours. You earned them. They're yours. Okay? So, next up is our High Five Spotlight. And this week, I heard through the grapevine, I'm not the one to gossip, but someone told me that the ARC came out. I don't know. I don't know where they were at, but I thought they'd been out. <laughs> but I heard they came out. And we have Bob. Here to give us some highlights because if you've seen the packaging that came out last week from the amazing videos to the coming out stories to some of the weirdest things that you've heard someone say to you about coming out, he's the magician, the magic, the creativity, and sometimes um, that person that is able to kind of communicate out what we're thinking. So he's normally behind the scenes, but kind of got him out to come on out, come on out, come on out, Bob. So thank you, Bob. This five is for you. Thanks for all you do. James, thank you for inviting me. I'm happy to talk about ARC. Uh, our launch was a lot of fun to put together and the video is definitely worth checking out. I also recommend everybody check out the story videos that were later in the email. Uh, there's some coming out stories and some fun stories about people who've been asked particularly silly or dumb questions about being LGBTQ+. And uh, if you haven't had a chance, please do sign up. We are both looking to get the message out and for people to participate. So we make sure that we get good representation all across the company of LGBTQ plus associates and allies. Hey guys, I'm Sarah Chulo sales manager at Avalon Cove in New Jersey, and I'm a lesbian. My name is Henry, and I'm a queer black man. My name is Megan, and I'm a pansexual female. We're just a small section of the L G E T Q plus community at Avalon Bay. And there's some things we want you to know. Why are y'all gagging so? They give it to you every time. Yes, thank you so much, Bob. Now, you know, if Bob has touched it or zhuzhed it, it has been stamped. So, thank you so much. Welcome, ARC, the Associate Rainbow Coalition. Watch the full lunch video because there are some celebrity cameos in that video. I, I just let the cat out the bag, but watch the video and definitely enjoy. All right, so now we have some special high five shout outs. Last week we had a trivia, 
High Five Trivia, and I said, who could guess what documentary this came from, docu-series, I keep messing it up, but where it came from, Opulence, O-P-U-L-E-N-C-E, it means you own everything. Everything is yours. And that is Paris is burning. Yes. Yeah, so shout out to Kurt Conway for getting that. And also to Robert Butler for saying, guess what? Don't forget that Mercedes Iman made it come back again and made it resurge. So yeah, she did opulence. You own everything. <laughs> However she said it, but it was so funny on Drag Race. So, remember, Lakers fans, you got it. Y'all did that. So, shout out to the other King James for doing your thing like you do. So, congratulations on pulling out that championship win. Woo woo! So, speaking of King James. Ah! <laughs> yes. So thank you all for nominating me for the Spirit of Caring Award for the first half of the year. Thank you for everyone that tunes in to Hi Fi Friday. It certainly feels like um, a daytime in me as I joked earlier about, um, but definitely I know it's from just doing the work and the work groups that I work with. So none of us do anything by ourselves. It's a team, it's a village. So, so appreciate everyone that I'm able to work with and brain bump with and just think through and help execute so many things from inclusion and diversity to learning and development to building strong communities to Connecticut, New York region to all across our company, just being able to collaborate with so many and make impact and foster that inclusive culture and climates that we all would like to have and deserve and just making sure to amplify those smaller or softer voices um, because there's so much treasure in that as well so thank you thank you thank you today is also bosses day so i want to give a shout out to all of our leaders out there for your influence my boss brad romano and also many of our bosses debbie and sarah all the way up to tim Notton uh and to sean breslin to anyone that's a leader within this company um, thank you um, we've been challenged this season in so many ways but you have shown your leadership and we thank you for that thank you all right so your affirmation and ponder for this week is we won't achieve perfection but we can achieve progression yes jump all the way in. stop waiting for everything to be just right just perfect put it out there put yourself out there put yourself on if we waited for inventors or if inventors waited for their product to be just right and perfect we'll be waiting for a long time think about the iphone it updates every two to three weeks it's always perfecting so put yourself out there you can do it and i forgot one other thing you have the right to vote Put your vote out there. It's bigger than us. It's bigger than you. Let's do this. Jump all the way in. I mailed my ballot in last week and it felt so good to do that, participate and do my duty. So join us with that. Send in a video of you dancing in horizontal form, 30 seconds, 40 seconds, just grooving out. We'll feature you. So Send that in, high five friday at avalonbay.com. Today I have a clip from this kid that was dancing. It looked like it was at a wedding or some type of celebration and he was just getting it. Hey, have a good one in the words of Aunt Tab. You go have yourself a good week, a good day. Shout out to our weekend warriors. But if you can't have a good one, don't you go messing up nobody else's. All right, okay, take care. Hey! Oh! <laughs>